Hi guys, PD here. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to another new video. This is Ocean Rift and it's now available on Steam. I did a first impressions video of this game when it first came out on the Oculus. I'll leave a link to that video in the description below and also in my Steam review. This version now works on the Vive. I'm just going to have a quick look at the menu, see what's changed. Right, straight away I can see believe animal facts was not on before it's now got an animal facts feature you can have audio text and then have text and audio you got controls is about you no longer have to point and click at the menu you just reach out and grab the experience you're interested in I'm going to show the great right shot all right, we're in a cage. And there should be, there he is. He looks absolutely amazing. This is so realistic. I feel like a diver stuck in a cage. You see bubbles flying around you everywhere. Wow, he looks amazing. sat in my chair I'm trying to stand up and have a good look at this guy right I can now walk around the cage I actually feel like I feel like I'm putting my hands out all oh, crikey he looks amazing oh it's a bit close yeah, he's trying to eat me help me Ooh. and he's banging the cage Ah, the cage is shaking. That's impressive. It looks so realistic. I've got a couple of bonus videos. I'll leave the links below. I showed this to the plumber and uh, also my wife's friend had a go. It's the first time they tried VR. The reactions are amazing to watch. So check them out. Cavern Crown. Alright, oh, I'm in a cage then. Yeah, look down, look, look up over you. Look up. That's bang on, isn't he? You're going to scare me now, aren't you, with a big shark coming out? There's, there's. Oh. Oh, my name's Jesus. I'm keeping my hands here. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to get bit. Yeah, keep your hands there. I'll put you on there. That's unbelievable work, don't you? Right. Look around you. Look everywhere. Look up. Could you? Yeah. Oh. oh my god. Look at that. You can look up. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Right. If you look forward, isn't it? Look. I'll show you some dolphins. Where's the dolphins? What? Oh, I can see. Oh gosh. I can see them. Oh, no, they're fish. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to head back to the uh, menu. Show you uh, a different experience. Let's have a look at the dolphins. Here's the dolphins. That icon's new. Alright, oh, the fans. You can move with the fans. That is really cool. I've not seen this before, this is new. Bottlenose dolphins are the most common and well-known members of the oceanic dolphin family. They are highly intelligent marine mammals, and like humans and great apes, can recognize themselves in a mirror. Bottlenose dolphins are very social creatures, and live in pods of between 10 and 30 individuals, which will cooperate, hunt, and raise young together. Dolphins join, split up, and rejoin pods in different combinations. And pods may sometimes combine for several minutes or hours to form larger social groups called herds. 
Dolphins communicate using a mixture of clicks, whistles, squeaks, and body language like jumping out of the water, tail flapping, and butting heads together. Being mammals, they need to come up to the surface to breathe, and most dolphin species can hold their breath for between 5 to 15 minutes. All dolphins are carnivores, and mostly eat fish and squid. They search for food using a technique called echolocation, like bats, where they emit sounds and listen for the echoes to determine the location and shape of nearby objects. These fans are amazing. The original game did not have this movement in it, and this is amazing. Found some crabs here. Crabs are a group of decapods from the crustacean family. There are this is superb now. Five hundred species of crab spread across the world. Parrot fish, oh, mate. Water and land masses. Crabs vary in size from the sub one centimeter pea crab to the giant Japanese spider crab, which can reach claw to claw. Well done, developers. This addition with the fans is amazing. There's an old shipwreck here. It's a lot easier to get around now. Before, you can still move, but you move very slowly. Now, the humpback whales were impressive. But they were very hard to find. Got an old plane here. The textures and detail in this game are amazing. Right, now before, it took ages to find the whales. But hopefully with these... I love all these little icons. The green moray eel, also known as the green conger, is one of the most common and largest species of eel, reaching lengths of up to two. Swordfish? Wow, look at him. He is huge. Wow, he looks amazing. Right, I can hear the whales. I need to locate the source. Here they go. Wow, it's a lot easier to find them now using these fans. Let's have a look what these are. Ocean Some sunfish, fish. also known as the common molar, is the heaviest known bony fish in the world, with adults measuring four meters in diameter and weighing up to They are meters. giant. They are found in temperate and tropical waters. Right, I've lost my whales. While ocean sunfish tend to swim around 50 to 200 meters below the surface, they are known Here we to go. dive to depths of 800 meters when hunting. These guys look amazing, they are huge. It's about 40 to 50 foot long. Too close there, swam into a him. Hello, mate. See his eyes and everything, lot. That's so cool. Before I go, I'm just going to have a quick look at the, um, the dinosaur one. It's not a very pleasant one, this one. Some old dinosaur bones. Now this guy will find you, hunt you, and eat you. See what type of dinosaur it is. Plesiosaurus were a genus of long-necked marine reptile that first appeared during the Jurassic period, about 200 million years ago. They belong to a family of marine reptiles called the plesiosaurs, which are named after them. While the plesiosaur family ranged in length between 1.5 meters and 15 meters, plesiosaurus were quite a small species, reaching lengths of about 3.5 meters. 
Plesiosaurs are characterized as having small heads, long necks, broad bodies, short tails, and two pairs of elongated paddles. We know from their body shape that plesiosaurs, and especially plesiosaurus, were not particularly fast or agile swimmers. However, they could still swim as fast as an Olympic athlete. It is also believed that plesiosaurs came ashore to lay eggs like sea turtles. So he's nasty. He will eat you. By humans, most famously in Loch Ness. They likely went extinct at the same time. He's so fast I can't keep up with him. Ah. Okay guys, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.